Welcome back to my channel, Technology in the Future. If you're a photography enthusiast or a professional looking for the latest updates on Nikon's flagship mirrorless cameras, then you're in the right place. Today, we're diving deep into everything we know about the Nikon Z9 II, addressing rumors, expected release timelines, and how this camera fits into Nikon's evolving mirrorless ecosystem. There's been a lot of speculation circulating in the photography community, but let's separate fact from fiction and explore what Nikon has in store for us. Nikon Z9 II, what we know so far. Rumors have been swirling about the Nikon Z9 II, with many questioning whether it will arrive before an upgraded Z8 model, or even a potential new Z7 iteration. Some sources have suggested that Nikon's focus for 2025 will be on the Z9 II, rather than rushing out a successor to the Z8 or Z7. But what does that mean for photographers eagerly waiting for their next upgrade? From what we've gathered, the Z9 II is shaping up to be a game-changer, particularly for wildlife and sports photographers. Nikon is reportedly making significant improvements in autofocus capabilities, burst shooting speed, and AI-powered tracking, all designed to make capturing fast-moving subjects easier than ever. If you remember the initial launch of the Z9, it set a new benchmark for flagship mirrorless cameras, delivering stunning 8K video, high-speed continuous shooting, and robust weather sealing. The Z9 II is expected to take these features even further, offering refinements in sensor technology, enhanced image processing, and even better low-light performance. Who is the Nikon Z9 II designed for? For those wondering whether the Z9 II is the right camera for them, the answer depends largely on your photography needs. As with its predecessor, the Z9 II is expected to cater primarily to professionals who require top-tier performance. Sports and wildlife photographers, in particular, will likely benefit the most from the upgraded speed, autofocus accuracy, and improved buffer capacity. That being said, for those using the original Z9 as a general-purpose camera, the necessity of an upgrade might not be as urgent. The Z9 remains a powerhouse, capable of handling a wide variety of shooting scenarios, from portrait and event photography to landscape and commercial work. However, if you're someone who constantly pushes the limits of your gear, whether it's for high-speed action shots, 8K video production, or extreme low-light scenarios, then the Z9 II might just be worth considering. Nikon Strategy – How the Z9 II Fits into the Lineup Historically, Nikon has followed a pattern of releasing flagship cameras first, followed by mid-tier models that inherit some of the high-end features. We saw this with the original Z9's launch, which was later followed by the Z8, a camera that delivered much of the Z9's power in a more compact form factor. If Nikon sticks to this pattern, the Z9 II will likely debut first, setting a new standard for mirrorless performance before the Z8 II eventually arrives. It's also worth noting that Nikon has been positioning its flagship mirrorless cameras as all-in-one powerhouses rather than segmenting them into specific photography categories like Canon has done with its R1 and R3 models. Canon, for instance, appears to be targeting the R1 specifically at sports photographers, with an emphasis on ultra-fast autofocus and high frame rates. Nikon, on the other hand, has taken a broader approach, ensuring that its top-tier mirrorless cameras are versatile enough to handle multiple genres, from wildlife and sports to studio and filmmaking. Expected Upgrades and Features So, what exactly can we expect from the Nikon Z9 II? Here are some of the most anticipated features. Improved autofocus. Nikon is likely refining its AI-powered subject tracking to compete with Canon's latest autofocus advancements. Expect even better face, eye, and subject detection. Higher burst shooting speeds. The Z9 was already a beast with its 20fps raw shooting and 120fps in lower resolution modes. The Z9 II could push these limits even further. Enhanced sensor and processing power. We could see a new stacked CMOS sensor with improved dynamic range and low-light sensitivity. 8K video refinements. While the original Z9 offered impressive 8K capabilities, Nikon could introduce better heat management, improved codecs, and more flexible frame rate options. Better battery life and cooling system. Nikon is rumored to be working on efficiency improvements to allow for longer shooting times, especially in video mode. Refined ergonomics. Nikon might introduce small but impactful design tweaks to improve handling and usability for professionals who shoot for extended periods. Pricing and availability. If Nikon follows its usual pricing strategy, 
The Z92 will likely be positioned at a similar price point to its predecessor, with potential discounts on the original Z9 to clear inventory. Currently, the Z9 has been seeing price reductions, dropping by as much as $500, bringing it closer to the $5,000 mark. Meanwhile, competing models like Canon's EOS R1 are expected to launch at a significantly higher price, potentially around $6,300. Nikon's aggressive pricing strategy makes its flagship cameras an appealing choice for professionals looking to maximize value. As for a release date, there is no concrete information yet. However, based on Nikon's historical release patterns, an official announcement could come in late 2025. If you're in the market for a new flagship camera, it may be worth keeping an eye on Nikon's upcoming press releases and industry events. Should you upgrade? If you already own a Nikon Z9, upgrading to the Z92 will likely depend on how much you rely on cutting-edge autofocus and burst shooting capabilities. If you're a sports or wildlife photographer, the enhancements could be game-changing. However, if your current Z9 meets all your needs, waiting for a future Z8 II or another mid-tier upgrade might make more sense. For those still using older Nikon DSLR models, the move to mirrorless is becoming more compelling by the day. Nikon Z-series cameras offer significant improvements in autofocus performance, video capabilities, and overall shooting flexibility compared to DSLRs. While DSLR technology remains reliable, the mirrorless future is here, and Nikon is investing heavily in advancing this technology. Final thoughts. The Nikon Z92 is shaping up to be a major release, solidifying Nikon's position in the mirrorless market. Whether you're a professional looking for the best possible performance or an enthusiast eager to stay ahead of the curve, this camera will be one to watch. As more details emerge, we'll be sure to keep you updated, so be sure to stay tuned. If you found this information helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. Your engagement helps grow technology in the future and allows us to bring you more in-depth coverage of the latest camera gear. Until next time, happy shooting!